Qualifying match number nine. Entering first, Memorialist Puerto Rico, the Boring Cross Briar, Andrea Freitas! Where is he? Huh? Hold on. There it is. is done and over with. As you can see, the James Gang won. Yeah. That just earned me another floating title shot to any title I choose. Now, now it's the Apocalypse Tournament. Now I want to get another floating title shot. I want to earn my keep here at WAW. Now the question remains, who is my opponent? I've been asking this question to every one of my homies, to everybody on Facebook, who is my first round opponent? Now, I saw Barry Ace shooting the shit with Buster Ross and Bloodfang downstairs. I saw Dangerous playing dice with Kung Fu Koo. I even saw Beefy talking to Shannon about forming a tag team. So there's a lot of options. Who is my opponent? Is it the Serpent Sensation Norway Charlie? I don't think so. Is it Mr. Oh man, I threw my back off because that's how I do. I don't think so. So please. Whoever it is, please come out. Make my day. Don't do anything stupid. Don't. Chad? Chad? You okay? Here's my question for you. Okay. What kind of ass did Sin have to kiss to get in the ring tonight? I'd rather not think about that considering who Reyes just listed off backstage. The however. fact is he can list off anything he wants. I've been in the ring with Sin, and you know what? Andreas draw the short stick for the APOC tournament. Well, I'm not arguing that point. The War Machine... Is in a hammer lock right now, reversal in a headlock. And showing why he is the War Machine, former president, multiple champion, good grief. Five-time WAW champion, Lord of the Ring. The guy has been around the block once or twice in his career, Pick but the fact remains... Kicker of epic ass. <laughs> now, that wasn't Sin. That was a completely different person that is not associated with this show. We won't uh, even talk about that. Okay. But the won't. fact is, all right... Now, that was outside problems. I don't even know why you're bringing it up. We both squashed that. Okay. That had nothing to do with the show. Okay. 
But the fact remains that it is a retired Hall of Famer coming back and taking someone else's spot. What a surprise. Well, off the ropes here, Andreas. Oh, no surprise. Big Close clothesline. Line. Wait a minute. And oh, clutches him again. Andreas going to oh, get in the hat trick. No. Kitchen sink. <laughs> Scouting sin. You know, Andreas, I mean, he doesn't know a lot of people. All the people that have been keeping his bat, keeping him back his whole career. Beautiful oh, suplex. Nolly Charlie, Sandy Shore. Friggin' Adu, as good as he was, he still held a championship match for those two. What happened? He bolts because his back. Sp oh, oh, speaking of back, back breaker. Well, Andreas now, if he wants to earn his it's title, strong. if he wants to prove that he deserves that title shot, if he wants to prove that he is championship material, here is his resume. Oh, here's right. his interview. Yeah, you know what? Oh, back goddamn body drop by Andreas Race to the War Machine Sin. And off the ropes, here we go. Two. Oh. Oh, haters gonna hate with a big knee. One, One, two. Nope, that ain't enough. It's gonna take a little bit more to take out the war machine. Indeed. But the fact remains, Andreas Race has already got the toughest challenge in the former WAW champion, the Hall of Fame of the War Machine, Sin. And here we go. Sin getting fired up, working on the abdominals. Of course he comes back, new president, dealer, there ain't nowhere to be found. Oh, and catches two feet to the mush, as you would say, Chaz. The mush. Yeah, well, you've got a mush. Things running here. Hang on, let me get to a tip here. Hold on. Into Up. The, oh, oh, wait, wait. Sin. Oh. oh. Banzai to Andreas. I mean, Sin's packed on a few pounds since retirement, so that hurt a lot more, I bet. Well, he's packed it on the right place if he's throwing around Andreas. That's right, cameraman. I'm a go. dick. You're a little dick, Chaz. Hang on, off I the still ropes, reversal. One. Off the and ropes, the corner. shoulder blocks. Now Andreas, now I'll actually come down a little bit on Andreas' side. He has done well working with Sage. He has you know what this is? What is this? This Chaz? right here into the corner, I know what's next. This right here is vintage Andreas race. Big splash, taking a little damage here. And Sin, if he was expecting an easy win here, he isn't getting it. Up on the shoulder, Oklahoma. Oh, boy. Oh, all the way down. Boom. And One, two. two. Nope. You know, I got to say, you might want to count a little bit of ring rust. All right, for the War Machine Sin not being in the ring since uh, Doomsday. Well, considering what we've seen tonight, this is uh, this has been one of the hardest com uh, hardest matches we've seen so far. Oh, wow, Both look at that beautiful modified follow the leader right there. Both these men experienced. Both these men. You see powerful. that he tapped. He tapped with his foot. No, he's not. That's tapping. That is not tapping. That's tapping with your I foot. I've been a ref. That is not tapping. Shut up. That's, That's races against the black man. He tapped. Oh. Well, Sin powering up here. Can he get out? Oh, of he here? reversed. Oh, oh, big elbows. This is where Sin's dangerous right here. Don't turn around. Don't turn around. It's oh, it's the oh the O-Ridge boot to the mush. The O-Ridge boot to the mush of Andreas Race. And there we go. The fans getting fired up now. Can Sin put the exclamation point on this? I mean, the fact is, oh, big oh, lefts and rights in the corner. Vicious as that day is long. Oh no, tree of woe. Hey, that rhymes. <laughs> you just noticed that? I've been drinking, Chaz. Come on. You're always drinking. Of course I am. They, that's because they always stick me next to you. However, Sin coming in. Oh, oh! hesitation drop kick to the mush. Yeah, it is mush at this point. Oh, Sin oh, might be setting up. Here we go. This might be it. Oh, wait, no. Catch it on belly to back. Go behind. Oh, shoulder oh. first. Think about the history of that shoulder, though. Kicks and, and oh, wait a minute. Up, El Rudo oh. on the war machine. One, two, three. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Now, I have given Andreas Grace a lot of credit to one of the very few people I would have thought he would never have to take down like that would be the war machine, too. Take nothing away from him. He just put away a Hall of Famer, probably the biggest win in his career. You know what's even better about that win? Sin goes back home into retirement. I don't have to see him.
Give it up for Andre Perez. Like that shirt. That's the guy that just beat me clean. And you know, not to uh, break scripts or anything, but that kid is talented. That kid could be the future in WAW. All he needs to do is stick with it, keep doing what he's doing. And that's the talent you're going to be talking about, like the likes you talk about Flax, the likes of Garbo, the likes of the Firebirds. You're going to talk about him in that light someday. Now, Chad gave me a bit of a weird look when I came on here. And I'm sure some of you are confused. Well, it's tough to get back. Doomsday, I put in that coffin and had a contract that said I couldn't wrestle here in Manchester anymore. Who's the president these days? Moody. Moody Star. Uh. You see, there was a little clause in that contract that stated, should Dirty Dealer ever decide to leave WAW, which it appears he pretty much has, uh. his contracts are voided. What that means is that I could come back here every single week if I wanted to. <laughs> I hate to disappoint you. We want you back. We want you back. Come on, Sam. We want you back. 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 Please come back and we want Sam. We want Sam. Well, I hate to disappoint, but I don't believe even though it was forced upon me, I'm enjoying retirement. No. I'm enjoying my Saturdays. Hey, I'm sorry, you know, t 10 years of coming in here and tearing knees and bulging backs and separating shoulders, it starts to hurt after a while. And as much as I do miss being inside of here, I'm going to stay happily retired. Yeah. However, if anybody ever decides they want to run their mouth, they want to try and call me out, don't worry, I'll answer your call and I'll tell you one simple thing. If you think you can stop me, try and stop me! The fact is, he's still retired. Now, the nice thing about retirement is you can come back anytime you want. wasn't dead. Well, I don't think Nacho's just going to be in a moment. Oh, he don't look happy. He doesn't look dead. Well, maybe he rose from the dead. I don't know. Wasn't he in the Cult of the Dead at one point? He was maybe. in the Cult of the Dead. So maybe he's like raised from the dead. Maybe Reaper resurrected him or something. He doesn't talk to the Merricks anymore. Oh, okay. Shut up! You said that! It was Matt Bishop! <laughs> what? What? Shut up! Don't throw me under that bus. <laughs> Catch the license plate. GR8-ness. 
more like epic fail. However, speaking of fail, I don't know now what I, I don't I, know what Nacho wanna... is going to do to this. To this. Well, I got to bring up something interesting in the past. As Nacho was just saying, Akane just in his headlock. Nachos does have a victory over Raging Demon Carnage. Really? Yes, he does. A triple threat victory. Oh, oh. follow away slam. Right into the ring. Oh. Oh. And he's choking him. He got still five. Did you know that? Yeah, I did. And I think that's going to be six more than Nachos can survive. However, he still got still five on this, oh, too. God. Kind of just mowing him down like a Taco Bell buffet. Oh. Who seriously? Who put these matches together? Like not just yeah, one victory. Do you read a book like However, puns for dummy? Is that where you get your material? What, are you saying my humor isn't good? <laughs> your humor makes Lan Lisa Lampanelli look funny. You oh, thank you. However, speaking of funny or not funny, Carnage now working in the corner here. Oh no! Oh! Ooh. That's gonna sting. Yeah, let, let's oh, angry boy. the big bald behemoth. Yeah. Well, let's make him angry. That's how much you hate nachos. Well, and nachos is getting destroyed who, in the corner. Who did nachos kick off to draw this match? Moody oh, Star? Boy. He didn't clean her toilet? Oh, that what it was. Okay, well. I mean, the fact is, Apocalypse and else choking and not. Oh, Big Whoa, Elbow hello. is a random lottery drawing. And I'm, oh, wait a minute. You mess with a bull, you get the horns. I stole that from you, unfortunately. Actually, in this particular case, he got the mule kick. And now. Oh, wait a minute. Kakarabunga. No. Oh. That. Oh! <laughs> I think he's going to be able to hit oh! the, note the national anthem now. That is not right. Oh. I don't even condone that. Oh, I'm not feeling so good right now. Uh, oh. There's something wrong if I don't condone it. Yeah, no kidding. Scrap oh! Buster! Jeez. And now Carnage. Oh, oh don't get up. No, don't, don't get up. Stay down. Nachos. Nachos, if you know what's good for you in those 60 Hold on. You got it all. Spear! Spear! Oh. oh God! Kata Hajime! Kata Hajime Nachos taps. That is it! Wow! Your winner, Carnage! Well, Carnage now shows. Not the music. Don't go! I'm not dead yet. I feel bad for whoever draws the unlucky number to take on Carnage next. Uh